Hello and welcome to our video series on digital teaching tools. In this video, we'll be focusing on the most used search engine and all its useful and interesting features. That is Bing. Bing is a Microsoft product now, which is now as Microsoft Bing. Bing has now remained renamed to Microsoft Bing in October 2020. Microsoft Bing is another popular search engine that takes place after Google. Also, the searching region on Bing is less than Google, but it takes second place after Google. Around 2.18% of searches are happening on Microsoft Bing. By default, Microsoft Bing comes with the Windows operating system. Bing has a reward program for starters. It allows to collect the points while searching. You can redeem these points at Microsoft or Windows stores, which is a good perk. Pros of Microsoft Bing Microsoft Bing comes with the Windows operating system by default, so you don't, you don't need to install it separately. Microsoft Bing ranks homepage, not blogs. Microsoft Bing has a large character limit than Google. It allows for 40 characters title, while Google for 25 only. Cons. When it comes to comparison, Bing provides a slow search result comparing with Google. It doesn't provide a simple interface like Google. Bing plus Yahoo, Call of the Leaf are not close to Google. Simply to find any content, we are going to write the word or content that we want to search for in a search bar. This place. Once we write what we want to search for, we will press enter. As you can see, the results are all content, all type of contents, not only image, but also videos, maps, news, and even more. In addition to promising improved search results, Bing now has a new feature called Chat, which is a conversational engine with which you can interact with natural language. The idea is that you can ask him complex questions and he will answer you in a more developed way than conventional search engines do. What Microsoft is training in this way is to find traditional search in a conversational format so that you have both in the same search engine. You can find charts here and you can ask wherever you want. We can try this for example. And now Bing will search an answer. This is an example. That's all. And that's all. We hope you found this tutorial helpful and we look forward to seeing the amazing video content you create for your students.